another cover crop you can consider using uh, are California wildflowers. So the function of this uh, is similar to the grasses in many ways in that they create uh, some erosion protection. They create some increased penetration and moisture in the soil. But the primary reason that I use um, wildflowers is to provide an offering to the local insects and birds. And I have a Phasalia tanisifolia, which is a native um, plant. It's used often in actually in orchards and it attracts uh, insects. Bees love this. They love it more than almost any plant that, that I know. And then I have a general uh, wildflower mix. And basically what I would do is I would uh, rake this and loosen it a little bit, this soil area here. And then I would be spreading the wildflower mix and covering it with what, what's called an arbor mix, which is a sort of a uh, ground up decomposed forest materials. And I would try to time it so that I would catch right before the rains, because again, this is an area that's not irrigated and I'm wanting to create a cover and a, a beneficial area for local insects and birds.